Hi, this is Bob Gersh with East Coast Capital. And today we're gonna to go over some key terms to know when buying a home. For more information on this subject, you can go to my blog, askbobgersh.com, and then scroll down to the bottom of the uh, uh, page and you can click on the uh, blog, which is Friday's blog, key terms to know when you're buying a home. Uh, we do a blog Monday through Friday. Uh, so uh, stay tuned for future additions. Key terms to know when you're buying a home. Some highlights. Appraisals. A key report highlighting the estimated value of the property completed by a qualified third party. Lenders rely on appraisals to validate a home's value and ensure they're not lending more than the home is worth. Closing costs. The fees required to complete the real estate transaction paid at closing. Ask your lender for a complete list of closing cost items, including points, taxes, title insurance, and more. Credit score. A number ranging from 300 to 850 that's based on an analysis of your credit history. This helps lenders determine the likelihood you'll repay future debts. Down payment. Down payments are typically three and a half to 20% of the purchase price of the home. Some 0% down programs are also available. Ask your lender for more information about what you may qualify for. Mortgage rate. The interest rate you pay to borrow when you're buying a home. As mortgage rates fluctuate, consult the lender so that you know how it can impact your monthly mortgage payment. Pre-approval letter. A letter from a lender that shows what they're willing to lend you for your home. This plus an understanding of your savings can help you decide on your target price range. Inspection contingency. A provision in a contract requiring an inspection to be completed. This essentially uh, is a step, and it's an essential step that gives you information on the home's condition and potential repairs. Affordability. A measure of whether someone earns enough to qualify for a loan on a typical home based on the most recent price, income, and mortgage rate data. When home prices and mortgage rates are higher, it can impact affordability. Equity. The value of your home above the total amount of liens against your home. Many homeowners are realizing that they have more equity than they thought and they're using it to move. Some highlights. Buying a home is a major transaction that can seem even more complex when you don't understand the terms used throughout the process. If you're looking to become a homeowner this year, it's important to know these housing terms and how they relate to the current market so that you can feel comfortable and confident throughout the home buying process. Let's connect so you can have expert answers to your questions as they come up. Again, this is Bob Gersh, East Coast Capital. And you can go to my blog, askbobgersh.com to read this and more information and come back next week, Monday through Friday. Each day we'll have a new blog. Thank you and have a great day and a great weekend. Thank you.